Hey guys, welcome back. Hope everybody's doing well. Um, thank you, for, thank you for watching this video. Um, today I'm going through all of my first aid vouchers. These are just the three main ones I normally use. I've got my foot care one I've just recently gone through, so I'm just going through all these today. But it got me thinking. Um, Got me thinking quite a bit actually. I know this one, this is the Condor EMT pouch. It got me thinking while well, I open this one up and talking to you. Um, I carry, I mean, I carry a lot of one thing. Well, a lot of one thing, but it's multiples of that one thing. That is, one of them is really bad. I have one in here. I don't carry this one every day. Just as, as you all know, this is my Dartmoor first aid kit. I have my quick deploy first aid kit, and I have one like right. there. And it got me thinking, I have one in here. I don't carry this one on my dark with dark when I go dark more. Just, just no point. But if I'm carrying my bushcraft class bag or my bagel bag or my inch bag, whatever you want to call it, bag, that's always on there. That's always on the shoulder straps. I don't usually carry this big first aid kit neither, but I'm going to start to. I'm going to start think. I'm going to start carrying it because I think I need to. If it's just part of my kit. I should really actually carry it, so I'm going to. Yeah, and um. As you can see, I have one there. That's two before we go anywhere, before I go anywhere. Yeah. These are my trousers. I go out in, I use all the time. I'm, I'm now gone into. Yeah. And in one of these pockets, again, I have another one. Yeah, I will go through in depth what I actually keep in my pocket, so my trousers. Yeah, so that's three. Yeah. I have one in my jacket, in my smock. I'm not getting that now because it's, you just got to take my, my advice on it. On my shoulder strap, on my shoulder pocket here, I have one there. It's like too many. That's one, two, three, four. Just on that kit, you know, just on my bug out inch bag, get home bag, or whatever you want to call it. It's not a get home bag, it's just too. I don't go that far away from home, I can be home within an hour, if that really. And that's even taking the long way around, I can still be home within an hour, maximum maybe two. But yeah, and I even EDC one, starting to EDC one now, and I even have one in my woods EDC pouch. So if you think about it, that's two on the EDC kit. That one there, that's three. That one there, that's four. My trousers, that's five. That's five Israeli style bandages. Is that too many? To me, personally, no. I know a lot of people are going to say, yes, I need to cut it down, it's, I'm hoarding, I'm carrying too many, or I'm hoarding and I'm having too much, but, yeah, I do like to carry it, and as you can, as you know, I've got that fat tourniquet there as well, and I've got a, a spot T tourniquet in here, so that's another thing I could be classed as hoarding, I've got too many, I've got two of them. But I got another one on the way, so we won't go into that today because I think that's just maybe it's too much. I may be just overthinking certain things. If I am, please let me know. But as I said to you before, I do class myself as a long wolf. Yeah. I know every single thing in my kit has to be layered. So I have one in my jacket, I have one in my trousers, I have one on my book sack, I have one 
and my drop leg. Let's take it. Yes, I know it's a lot. I get that, I understand that. But everything's layered in my system. I will show you the layers, slowly going through the layers again, because at the end of the day, I'm slowly updating some pieces of the kit. Like, as I said, I'm going through my first day stuff today, and I just realised that I'm carrying five first, five, five, five even really bandages just when I go out. If I'm not taking that, it's four. But I've always got that on me. I've always got one in my pocket. I've always got one in my jacket, and I've always got one in my woods easy C kit. And I might even have my easy C kit, normal easy C on me. So, tell me what you think. Yeah. I know I've gone through a video like this before with the bear rod. The firewall toggles. But these are pieces of kit what I'm actually enjoying. And I'm looking to, to get more. I'm not looking to get more, but looking into doing more with. So thank you very much for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, please do. And please hit the thumbs up if you can. If you like this video. If not, please put the thumbs down, but please tell me why. And yeah, thank you very much for joining us today in this video. And we'll see you in the next one. Thank you.